it's Janie, it's Karen, Purple Cows. I am making this video to officially accept your challenge. And my response to that is, it's on. I am accepting your challenge and I am well on my way. Wanted to thank you for your encouragement and your motivation. I think that we've been um, swimming in the same waters, so to speak, because we've caught the same wave. <laughs> it's funny how that happens. I have been struggling with my motivation for, especially for the month of November. November has been rough for me. And it was very easy to make excuses about why I shouldn't get in 10,000 or more steps a day. Um, I, think, I think you just get to a point if you let it slide one day and then the second day and then, well, maybe you get 10,000 in the third day, but then it goes back to, well, I did get 10,000 in yesterday and... It is so easy to fall into the trap of making excuses. And you know what I've been thinking about? Um, especially on Sunday. Sunday was a good thinking day. Um, it took me a long time to get to the point to where I was able to uh, get to the surgery. Having that surgery was the beginning of a new life for me. And... While there are physical changes happening in my body, and it's exciting to, um, to look in the mirror every day and see that person uh, changing and feeling so much better about herself and looking so much better, looking more healthy and feeling vibrant and alive, I felt more alive than I have ever felt right now. Um, just with the weight loss, but it amazes me how much more um, alive I feel with exercise. And walking did that for me. Walking has made all the difference in the world for me. And to and to let that slack off, I must be crazy. <laughs> I must be crazy to let that go. Um, part of my problem, I think, is that I did not set defined goals for my walking, um, except for get, you know, I just wanted to get in 10,000, just get in 10,000, and um, that's not enough for me anymore. I want to do more than that because I know that I'm capable of more than that, um, but at the same time, I want to be consistent. I want to consistently get in uh, at least 10,000 because I know I can do that. So... This morning, um, well, yesterday, let me back up. Yesterday, I did get in 10,000 steps. It was very difficult because um, I hadn't pushed myself like that for several days. And um, it, was, it was hard to get them in. But um, I did. And then today, after I had watched your video early this morning, right as I was uploading mine, I thought, this is something I can do. I can take little chunks of time and do some steps. So what is on my pedometer is what I did throughout the day. To, um, keep in mind that my job, for the most part, is sedentary in that I'm sitting in front of a computer all day. I'm looking at documents all day. Um, but I was able to get up and step in between, take breaks, um, walk down the street, walk walk across the street to my car, a couple of trips, doing this, that, and the other. And this is what um, small chunks has accomplished for me today. I have 6,537 steps so far. Um, that's not bad, considering I haven't been on the treadmill yet. So it's really working. 
Um, so, Miss Janie, I hope you're not sorry that you issued this challenge to me because it's on. I've accepted your challenge, and I want to encourage anyone else out there that needs the motivation to get it going on again. Um, every day is fresh with no mistakes in it. You can start every day all over again. It's new. And I would just encourage you to get moving. Get moving because it makes the biggest difference in the world. And I'm getting ready to share with you my exciting news. So let me get this out and I will share that news. Thanks, Miss Janie. I'll see you on walking spree. And um, every hour, I'll be thinking, I wonder how many steps Miss Janie has yet. Hmm.